Hi, this is Manny with Daddy Cool Records in St. Petersburg, Florida, here to talk with you about the new releases for Friday, August 20th, 2021. Before we get into the new releases, let's give you some updates with the store. Um, you may have heard that we are moving. That has now been pushed back to November. Our neighbor, the fairgrounds, is set to open September 2nd. So if you'll see some stories in the paper about them, check them out. It's going to be a real cool thing. They're opening in September, and then we'll be opening right next door to them, hopefully in November. Um, also, throughout our history, you will have known us to be the place to come and get your concert tickets. We are no longer selling tickets in the store. We have some links for tickets on our website, daddycool.com. That will take you to Ticketmaster, and you can buy your tickets that way. And if you follow the links from our website, you, we will receive a small credit for doing that. Or sometimes there will be pre-orders available, and you'll use the code COOL in those pre-orders. So we are still in the ticket game, so to speak, but we are not selling tickets. Okay, so I know it's a bit of a, an adjustment, but that's where we're at. Uh, the hot, hot pre-order for this week is going to be Every Time I Die. Their new album is called Radical. It comes out October 22nd. It is a double LP on opaque lime vinyl, and you can order that right now on our website, daddypool.com. All right, so let's get into the new releases for Friday, August 20th, starting with After 7, called Unfinished Business. This is a long-awaited new release from After 7, the old R&B group. Next up, we have AJR, OK Orchestra. This uh, came out recently on Compact Disc, and now you can get it on Limited Edition Orange Final. Okay, next up, we have Trey Anastasio Band. This is recorded live in 2019. It is called Burn It Down, and it is on orange colored vinyl. Next up, we have a new release from Devendra Bandhart and Noah Georgeson called Refuge. This is on blue sea glass wave translucent vinyl. A new release from them. Okay, next up, Bob's Burgers, the TV show. This is the second volume of a, of a soundtrack from Bob's Burgers. This is a two CD set. You can get this now. The vinyl and cassette has a release date of September 24th. Okay, after Bob's Burgers, we have Darren Bradbury. This is the latest album called Artvertisement. We have it on compact disc, and hopefully we will be seeing the vinyl later today. Next up, we have Capstan. New release from them, we have it on limited uh, pink colored vinyl, as well as a super limited purple, one of 500. Next up, latest release from Death Heaven called Infinite Granite. It is a double LP. Alrighty, next up we have a new release from Anderson East titled Maybe We Never Die. We have it on compact disc, as well as this limited edition vinyl. Alrighty, next up we're expecting a new release from Sierra Farrell later today. That's an indie version. Hopefully we'll be seeing that coming in this afternoon. Next up we have Fink. This is a, a new album from Fink. It's a on compact disc. These are reworkings of some of their uh, previously released songs. Next up we have GA20 does Hound Dog Taylor. We have this on vinyl, a limited edition colorway. Next up, one of my favorites, Chrissy Hine. She's doing songs of Bob Dylan, um, and it's not like the most popular Bob Dylan song. She went really deep into the catalog of Bob Dylan to record this record. So we have it on compact disc as well as on vinyl. Next up, we have the latest from Lord called Solar Power. We have it on a brown colored uh, vinyl, as well as this interesting little artifact right here. This is called the Discless Music Box Edition. There is no CD in here. There is a uh, download code for the full album, as well as bonus tracks, access to exclusive content, a poster, a booklet, and cards. So it's, this is for uh, an option for somebody who wants to buy something but doesn't want to buy the vinyl. You can get this discless 
Music Box Edition. And like I said, it has a download code for a high-res version of the disc as well as all sorts of other cool content. Next up, James McMurtry. We have his latest on compact disc as well as on an indie exclusive colorway vinyl. Offspring have a new 7-inch out titled We Never Have Sex Anymore and the B-side of it is that in French. The Resistance Revival Chorus, This Joy. This is a release on Righteous Babe Records. It says here that it, the Re Resistance Revival Chorus is a collective of more than 70 women and non-binary singers delivering their debut album, featuring original compositions and protest classics. Guests on this album include Rhiannon Giddens and Valerie June. It is on red colored vinyl. All right, next up we have the long awaited vinyl release from Olivia Rodrigo. The CD's been out for a little bit. The single's been out for a lot of bit, but here we are, here it is on vinyl. Come and get it while we got it. Next up, Settle Your Scores, a new release from them we have on vinyl. Next up, we have Shannon and the Clams, a new release from them. We have it on CD as well as vinyl and vinyl. This one here is a white limited edition, white colored vinyl. Next up, we have the latest from Sturgill Simpson. This is on CD. The vinyl is expected out in December. This is the same, pretty much with the same band that he recorded the Cut and Grass albums with. And it features vocals from Willie Nelson on one track. How awesome is that? Next up, we have the latest from Stimulator Jones. This is a Peanut Butter Wolf curated album of instrumental beats, and it's out on the Stone's Throw label. Okay, next up, we have the latest from Switchfoot. Apparently, Switchfoot has switched up their sound, and you can check it out on their latest LP, Interrobang. Tadashi Trucks, they have a new release out today on Compact Disc. It is a two disc set. It is the Layla Revisited. They recorded the classic album by Derek and the Dominoes, Layla. This is a live recording featuring Trey Anastasio on guitar as well. Next up, July Flame from Laura Veers. We have this on clear vinyl. Alrighty, next up we have a new release from Villagers called Fever Dreams. We have this on compact disc as well as an indie version vinyl album with a cool die cut cover. Next up, Martha Wainwright. Love Will Be Reborn. We have this on compact disc as well as on vinyl. And lastly, with the new releases, there's still so much more left. With the new releases, we have a new one from Wolves in the Throne Room, Primordial Arcana, and it is on this awesome, cool colorway. Next, we're gonna get into the reissues that are coming out today, August 20th, 2021. First up, we have a reissue of the Aaliyah album, One in a Million. We have it on compact disc. The vinyl is set to come out in 2022. Timings are pretty appropriate with this release, I have to say. Belly, this is Bees on Run Out Groove. This is a collection of B-sides. Double LP, I do believe. Next up, we have Reissue of Kenny Burrell's Midnight Blue. This is the Blue Note Classic Series on 180 gram vinyl, mastered from the original analog tapes by Kevin Gray at Coherent Audio. Okay, next up, it's a big day for Eric Clapton. Not only does his first solo album get the reissue treatment, but you got the Tadashi Trucks. Okay, this one here is a new album, but we're putting it in the reissue category. This is another side of John Coltrane. We have it on compact disc as well as vinyl. This uh, collects tracks that Coltrane cut as a sideman. So you will have him with Miles or Monk and Art Taylor and Sonny Rollins. So really, really killer stuff. Awesome collection. It is a two LP set. Okay, next up we have Dawes with their album Nothing Is Wrong. This is a 10th anniversary version of this release. It is on milky clear vinyl. It includes a bonus 
seven inch as well as a download code for the album and the bonus tracks. More Clapton. Goodfellas soundtrack reissued on vinyl. Great movie, killer soundtrack featuring such artists as the Moonglows and the Cadillacs and Aretha Franklin. And then as you get towards the end, you have a couple Clapton tracks with Layla and Sunshine of Your Love from Cream, as well as Muddy Waters Manish Boy. So a killer, killer soundtrack for a killer movie. No pun intended. Okay, next up we have Grant Green's Idle Moments. Again, this is a Blue Note classic series reissue on 180 gram vinyl, mastered from the original analog tapes by Kevin Gray at Coherent Audio. Next up, the hardest working man in show business might not be Charlie Brown, it might be Kevin Gray at Coherent Audio, who also cut this remastered version of A Boy Named Charlie Brown by the Vince Guaraldi Trio. This here features this classic Charlie Brown on the pitcher's mound cover, and it has eight baseball cards of peanut characters inside of it as well. So how cool is that? All right, next up we have Lee Morgan, The Complete Live at the Lighthouse. This is a 12 LP set. Lee Morgan played the lighthouse in Hermosa Beach, California, one weekend in July of 1970. This captures all the shows each night 100% here. You can relive the whole experience minus having to wear clothes from the 70s. All right, next up we have a couple of very long awaited reissues for Tampa Bay metal fans as well as just metal fans in general. Sabotage has reissued their first two albums. So we have Sirens on turquoise colored vinyl as well as the Dungeons Are Calling on red vinyl and this features a bonus seven inch. Now we're gonna go a little off script with the, with the releases to let you know about this awesome used album that we have. This is the, if you grew up in the area in the 80s, WYNF was the rock station, the pirate radio station, and they put out these great compilation records. This one here from 1983, I believe, features pre-sabotage John Oliva in a band called Avatar. So there's a couple Avatar tracks on this compilation record, as well as other cool bands like the Headlights Band and the Adults. So you can um, get a slice of what it was like to go see a show in a club in Tampa in the early 80s. All right, next up after that classic YNF flashback, we have another flashback with a reissue of Typo Negatives, Slow, Deep, and Hard. And next up, we have Volbeat with Hocus Bonus. This album here features bonus tracks from previous Volbeat records, all collected here on Wax. And that is gonna wrap up our new releases and reissues for Friday, August 20th. Hopefully we will see you soon. You can find this whole list on our website, daddycool.com. You'll find the list of new releases, as well as these awesome used records that we have put out, you'll find lists for those and all sorts of other cool things. So check us out on our website, daddycool.com.